Welcome everyone, this is Dusk Unlock S That Gamer, and this is the game Hide, which is with a Y instead of an I. Subtitles, let's get straight starting this game, I guess. This is live stream of YouTube peoples. It's behind me. Just a big blank of white wall and an elevator, I guess, is where we came from. Here we go from up or down. Uh, probably either or, no. There's a big painting over here that's mostly written, splayed out. Kind of weird, but that's okay. Over here. Another day of pointless hand holding, showing qualified people how to do their jobs. Kind of messing around about tutorials. Funny game. No, not really, actually. Welcome home, Henry. Okay, you gonna go to the apartment across from us? No. Just into here we go, I guess. We apparently have very nice things. We have a big TV, we have roses that are not even trained. Those flowers from a secret admirer. More likely a gold digger. Roses, of course. Like the ones I took to the graveyard. And TV. Oh, 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 blacking out. Apparently, all I have to do is look at roses, and I passed out cold. And suddenly our apartment has turned into a giant cave. What the freaking hell? There's a world outside this cave, though, which I guess I have to make my way to. Seriously, I want to explore our apartment, and then we just... Boom. Maybe a dream, but I still think outside looks a little bit too detailed. It was a relief when Father died. I was free of him. His expectations. His condescending remarks, his disapproval. Well, sounds like he doesn't really like his dad all too much, so I guess that's okay. What? That's returning. Returning to him. To our left, nothing. To our right. Giant pool of either blood, a blood or magma. Probably supposed to be blood. Can we run? No, we cannot use shift to run at least. And there's no obvious run button. It's not a mouse keys. Just a bunch of walking, and just as expected, we go outside into the snowy world beyond. He didn't deserve to be buried here. He deserved nothing but a nameless gravestone. And I was here to deliver. You guys think we should go forward, right over there, or to the right, over there? They probably both lead to the same area, but there are two choices in front of us. So it means we have to figure it out. Forward. Forward. Go forth, right. Lots of forward peoples immediately there. Yes, it's forward it is, I know. It's snowing, I hadn't noticed. This game actually... Those are mountains, though. A little bit weird, but... All these directions. Okay, the graves are this way, apparently. I guess there. Before I look at the graves, can I open up this door? Is it going to be locked, or what's up? It's locked. So into the graveyard we go. A grave and dig and we go. A grave digging, we go. <laughs> he was buried amongst the other forgettable masses. He wanted to be with Mother, but after everything, I couldn't have that monster buried down the ladder again. All right. Uh, can't quite say I know what grave is his. Maybe it's the big door. Maybe he has, for some reason, a big grave all to himself. I guess it means he was really special. But of course, secret passageway down to the crypt. That leads to this giant big grave with a rose on it. She wouldn't have wanted this. She wouldn't have ex expected better. She was an angel among savages. I, 
I miss you, Mum. Cool. Well, apparently he has mother issues there. I'm not sure how we should tell him about that, though. And not who he's looking for. He is looking for the other person who is her uncle? I don't know. Yeah. Let's go over this way. Time to do go some grave digging. Nothing. Nothing. I don't know who where his grave is to be honest. I was kinda looking. Is that your grave? Nope. I really there was no one left to guide me now. Not my ever loving mother. Or my father. I was alone. That's cool. Which grave is his? I really don't know. I think it'd be a really extravagant grave, but there are quite a few graves soon around, so. Hmm. Oh, here we go. As self assured as I appeared. I suddenly felt scared. After all this time, I had spent learning the ways of a business tycoon's son. I didn't know what to do. I just didn't know. Yeah, yeah. Well, the only thing to do, let's see, can we sneak around to the sides? Yes. We approach all of the, wow, that's a whole lot of roses. Like a lot of roses. This guy must be pretty loved. Which means that uh, probably we're a terrible person that Did dislikes I ever this person. Have a chance to be someone different from who I am. Yeah. And we awaken back up in our room. Apparently that's all we want to do with flowers. The door doesn't want to open though. Let's take a look in the fridge, I guess. Hey fridge. Or anything that happens to be like a fridge, but just not quite a fridge in the first place. Oh, lots of I should really put those knives away. Anyone would think I was operating in here. Ah, you look at stuff, then you disappear. Next up, knife stories, apparently. Uh, nursery. There is a reflection, but I am not in it. Alright, let's see, uh, rooms 200 through 202, uh, Rezu Kitchen Area, Intensive Care, Acute Assessment no Unit. No one would ever believe this place was one of healing. At least, at night. That, of course, is locked, which means we should probably go through the one door that's probably open. Which probably is, because it's nice, wide open, and everything. Deeper into the depths of whatever this place is. Can we push this out of the way? No, but for some reason we can clip through it. So that makes logical sense. This door is going to probably be locked. Yep, which means over here we go. Oh no. Sounds are starting up. That means things are about to get scary in here. There was only one time I saw Father at the hospital. He was arguing with the receptionist about Mother's treatment. At that moment, I felt perhaps the closest thing to affection I could for my father. Okay, let's go turn around the corner like it was expected of us to do. All of the long hallways. As we pass by giant hospital doors to examine. Uh, this is an indie game, by the way. A look. Mother was often in chemotherapy when I visited. She would always sit in the garden looking so tired, but it never stopped her from putting on a brave face. So her mother had cancer, I'm going to assume, but she he as she was being treated by chemotherapy, so yeah. I Let's go over here. I thought I saw something. 
I'm not sure though. Let's go over here. They're having any screamers yet, which is fine by me, but. There's something walking here besides us. She, father, didn't let me see her in the final stages. My schoolwork was too important, and because of that. I never got to say goodbye. She was gone. There's lots of books. To be honest, I'm kind of nervous by this walking noise I hear. I haven't met anything. Ooh. Completely normal. Back. Mother, please. No, 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 no! Have fun with that. Uh, this is Hi. I am now inside the big box library. The wall. A would be guest room. Should the need arise. Cool. Nothing over there, which means I guess I'm gonna go to this red wall. Or not. I should I just go to the window? Jenny hasn't called in a while. Oh. Strange. All of my calls go straight to voicemail. Exciting story there, mister. Guess let's go to the end of the hallway. Ah, we are back in our apartment. Let's see, so we've looked at roses, we've looked, uh, we've looked at knives, pills. Those are a lot of pills. Music? No. Anything else for us to investigate? To have weird memories about weird things? Like maybe those plants over there? Let's take a look. Probably gave his mom cancer. That'd be a stupid plot twist. But still, let's see. How lucky am I to be afforded the luxury of elevating myself above that filthy pinnacle? We're gonna fade out again? I honestly thought we were gonna fade out again. Why do you have so many pills around? Nice well organized now, but uh, where was this investigation? Here we go. Prescriptions, therapist sessions, and more prescriptions. What good are these clinical trials really? Now we're gonna fade out. Nope. What does he want to look at to fade out? Door is an opening. Ah, there's another door open inside our house. Let's go investigate. Try a TV. It's not the TV. There's a door open right there, so let's go there. I work hard. I control my fu my company, and I'm rewarded for my efforts with more work. Keeping me under the thumb no matter what. Hey, Pops. A photo from my high school graduation. I wasn't sure whether I felt ecstatic or horrified. Alright. Are we going to a school now? My guess. Graveyard, hospital, school. Sounds like it'd be something this game might try to do. here so yeah, this guy has some major dad issues even though I'm, I think this is supposed to be a school this is reminding me more of one of the like 
this reminds me of one of the rooms inside School. Resident Evil Code Veronica. Unlike most, I don't recall much. Only that I resented others and that it cost a lot for me to live and study here. Okay, we'll go this way. And up. Let's see. Now I like this game. I don't think I sound bored, but I did just recently wake up, so let's see. I'm intrigued by this game. I'll always remember my first day. My luggage thrown at me with a parting phrase of do well and you can come home to visit. Nothing over there. Maybe he paid to have his reflection removed? Of course. He's like, don't let me look at myself. I need to pay to let me remove my reflection from this world. For some reason, the graphic I mean, the graphics in this game aren't, like, terrible, but they're not really great either, but I feel like the graphics in the school area look a little bit worse than, so far, the other two areas so far. Ooh. Burns. I say that, and then I walk into a sunny area, and I think it looks kind of I made no decent. effort at hiding my distaste for the other kids. Still, they flocked around me like... Well, okay then. Let's just walk over here into the bridge of fun. Taking our route down. So far, this game seems like to be straight path the game, but not that it's a bad thing. I've been intrigued by it. And I guess there's nothing to my left. So, thus, I'll try it to my right. Yep. It's probably you I need to go down. Let's see. Music is nice. What is this? Library? Yep, no need to open that right now. Let's go up here. Why can I not go up here? No, I can't. I would ask for directions from you guys usually, but it seems this game only has one direction they want you to go down. So I wouldn't really have much of a point. I felt different around them, the way I talked and behaved. I was called to the principal's office quite a few times to discuss arguments and fistfights that I never remembered. I would like to cross this bridge once. Look at all of the pigeons cross over me. I think I like things that way, though. I felt different. Powerful. Even if they said it was a disorder. Something about an ultimate me. I didn't care. I felt good. I think there's something a bit wrong with you, Miss Step, but that's okay. Let's go over Sometimes here. the teachers would give me strange looks. Fearful, even. It was almost like they saw something terrible in me. I don't think they were the only ones, bro, Nick. All right, let's try and investigate this classroom. Walk up to the board, we will. One of the guys said I scared him, especially when I got angry. Apparently, I didn't sound like myself. What a ridiculous notion. Who else could I sound like? And it fades out. I wasn't done exploring everything there either. And everything's red. A uh, red world, whatever. And all day and all night, everything I see is red. Inside, and why is it red? He wanted me to be this way. He turned me into this. Be ruthless, Henry. Well, can you see it now? Is this what you wanted, father? I'm pretty sure your dad didn't want you to run around your apartment memorizing really old memories and screaming to yourself in red lights. That's just a guess, though. How are you feeling today, Henry? I feel like I want to rip your spine out, you condescending, pseudo-scientific bastard. Right, they people. They my bay, but there's nothing wrong with me. I'm just exacting natural selection. That's one way to think of it, Henry. 
That's his name, right? Henry. So I kind of put together from this. Alright. He seems to be moving even slower than usual in this one. But that's okay. Oh, Henry's my father. Okay, yeah. Which means blood this way. Is that? What is that? Is that someone? Oh. Hi, Jenny. So that's where you've been hiding. Hi. Oh. I get. Ah, oh, really? <sighs> of course. That was a weak plot twist. I thought I was about to go someplace more interesting, not end the game. I get it. She was hiding because it's like Mr. Hyde. And also hiding because she's high, whatever. Still, though, I felt like you would have gone through another area and then maybe Jenny would have found out. It feels like there could have been more to this game. And I was actually somewhat disappointed because of that. Not a bad experience game, though. Just. Felt like it could have more to it. So that was high. 